All right, so let's finish up this uh, acacia tree farm. Uh, I, I'm trying to, like, not take too long to get these done. Uh, but uh, I, I've decided what my next major project uh, is going to be. And, 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 it's, and it sounds pretty lame on paper. Uh, our next major project is going to end up being... A, a bamboo farm. Although I have some pretty solid reasoning as to why it's going to be a bamboo farm. Mainly the fact that uh, we need sticks and a lot of them. Namely the fact that uh, we need uh, about 64 sticks to get uh, two emeralds. So if I have like a ton of uh, bamboo farms going, I can sort of uh, get a good chunk of uh, emeralds from that. Alright, so now we just need to fill this in. Alright, let's, uh, let's grab this copper and coal. I could, I could always use more coal for, uh, coal blocks. Not like I'll use it for anything else. Uh, I don't think there's, like, any, uh, crafting recipe I'll end up using coal for. Alright, so let's, let's fill in this entire area here. Yeah, I know, this is not, like, the most organized way of doing this here. But, uh, just trying to get this filled in. In a, uh, timely manner here. And what we're gonna well, what we're gonna end up building next though is we're gonna build like an enclosure around the nether portal. Uh, that is something I kind of needed to do. Well, I kind of need to do. And I've been holding off on it, so now is like the best time to do that. I am gonna have to like flatten out the surrounding area, but uh, that's not a big deal now. And as soon as I get, uh, some beacons going, uh, things will get, things will be a lot faster. Uh, I, I, I recently learned how to set up a world eater, uh, like in Doc M77's video. But, uh, unfortunately, uh, I really don't want to bother setting that up until I get, like, elytras and whatnot. And, like, a good supply of redstone and all of that. Like, a lot of the endgame farms require a lot of manpower to build. Like, a lot of the farms on Hermitcraft uh, that I see, I'm like, you can't build that without a lot of technical know-how and a lot of time. Then again, like, most of the people who, uh, play on Hermitcraft, uh, professionally make Minecraft videos, so, uh, they have plenty of time to do that. So there is that. Uh, I am gonna probably slip in some, uh, some lanterns here and there. Just to, like, show the uh, erratic nature of this farm.
Like, the erratic nature of this farm is not exactly, like, the most convenient way of doing things. Okay, here we go. Let's go. I'm gonna run out of planks here. But that's to be expected. Considering the uh, nature of what I've got going on here. Like, I, 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 I will reprimand myself on, like, the fact that all of my farms require, like, a gratuitous amount of wood. Uh, over here. And, and like, the thing is, is I could build, like, a good chunk of my farms out of dirt, and they'd still just be as functional. But... It, it's more of, like, a pride thing. You don't, you don't want to build things out of dirt, because they don't look good. Like, at a certain level, there's, like, this general expectation you're gonna build things to sort of look alright. That's not to say that you can't try to make everything look absolutely amazing. You can try. Oh, there's like a big chunk here that is missing some lighting. There we go. And now it's raining. But uh, I want to get this filled in. Like, that, that's, that's a general thing I want to do. Oh, there's like a large chunk here that could use some lighting. There we go. And now we need more wood. So, uh, start chopping trees, boys. We're doing this as we go. to stack, but we will, uh, 
and go ahead and continue working here. Not a big fan of this rain, but it it's kind of just something that happens in Minecraft. You can't you can't stop it. All right, let's uh grab some more planks here. Like building this as I go is not exactly working out for me too well. And I and I wish I wish I used something other than jack-o'-lanterns to like outline this because uh it's really hard to like make this out when it's raining but it's whatever all right so we're gonna run on over to the house here yeah I, sh I should put some sort of like covering over this but I, I, I just don't want to bother with it. Uh, maybe later. Alright, so let's get back to building this up here. We're filling it in. With this, we'll have a stable income of uh, acacia logs. Unfortunately, I don't have like a way to like automate this. Much to my regret. <laughs> like, I don't I don't think I've seen an automatic acacia farm. Uh, that's something I'm gonna have to look into. Because I, I don't think I, there, there is a way to automate the uh, harvesting of acacia. It, it's not like with the uh, oak trees over there where uh, you can TNT them and bone meal them. After this recording session, I'm gonna have to stop and go get the mail because I hear the mailman outside. We should just like need to harvest like this last batch of trees and then we'll have enough uh, planks to do what we want. Now let's grab this uh, copper here. It's unfortunate you can't use copper for beacons, but oh well. Alright. Let's uh, grab as much of this as we can. And begin our harvest once more. Also, these acacia trees, like, grow super high. Like, if... I, I would have done this underground if I could. But, unfortunately, they... They grow so high that it's not really feasible to do stuff in caves.
right, that's some more stacks, which we need. Go ahead and continue filling this all in. Did I get everything? Looks like it. Oh, nope, missed some spots over here. So, we get this all placed down, and we will be free to move on to other projects. Although, uh, I've done a bit of math, and by the time, um... Alright, so I, I have this policy here where I'm not deleting any of, uh, the footage. Uh, from, uh, this series. And, uh, th this is an interesting subject I, I hadn't really thought about until recently. Um, a majority of my film hard drive is taken up by, uh, old uploads from Minecraft 365 here. And I've done some math, and by September I will have run out of hard drive space. So I'm gonna get myself a couple of, uh, portable hard drives. And I'm going to offload all of my, like, old footage to that. At least that's my plan. And yet again, I am, uh... Pretty much out of logs. <laughs> Because, uh, this whole entire thing takes up way too many, uh, planks. Should have used slabs. But no, I had to be, uh... Stubborn and... Not use slabs. So we'll just go ahead and uh, grab all of these. So we'll just go ahead and go through here and Harvest what we can. Yeah, uh, one of these days, this is actually just going to end up being purely for decoration. Because, uh, lo looking ahead, if, if I look far enough ahead in, like, my mental mind, I'll get to a point where... Uh, Minecraft will pretty much, uh, have a way to automate a lot of things. But right now, I don't have that capability. So... So I'm just gonna fill this all in. And we will be done with this for now.
Like, I swear, I chew through, like, my wood, uh, my plank supply super quickly. We're gonna, we're gonna need even more planks, because every time I think I have enough, it's like, no, you're gonna need more. Plant that down, and let's fi let's finish strong here. Dang. Okay. Well, that's unfortunate. Like, I heard it, and then I'm like, oh, no. I was so wrapped up in, like, placing planks down that I'm like, that'll be fine, right? go we are done uh we do need to like work on the outer pathways but i think now is a good time to stop i have put i have spent an hour working on getting this done uh total time to get this all put down uh about two hours i guess uh, if we're gonna estimate how much time we spent there So, uh, why don't we, uh, go ahead and spend some time trading with you. Alright, 
right. Uh, can how many do you need? Okay, you need uh, four books to an emerald. Wait a moment. Ah, uh, no, no, that wouldn't work. Wait, what chest did I put my emeralds in? Ah, oh, I must have put them somewhere and I've forgotten where I put them. Oh well, not a big deal. Alright, so I think this is all I'm going to do for, for today in regards to Minecraft. Uh, next time, I'm going to go ahead and build like a structure for the... Uh, nether portal and then i'm gonna be looking into uh potential uh how do i put this uh potential uh mob farms yeah potential mob farms because uh, i need a lot of bone meal and this, the amount of bone meal I'm getting from composting is just not enough. So I need to diversify my bone meal uh, acquisition process. Yeah. I, I, I also need to, like, look into, like, getting my, uh, mods back so I can just go ahead and, uh, get my, uh, what's it called? Uh, there's a term here. Oh, yeah. Uh, get my mods back so I'll, I'll have, like, less of these, like, rendering issues. So, Minecraft as a game is, like, super old, so it's not exactly optimized to run on the newest hardware. So, yeah. Uh, that'll be all for today.